Hi and welcome to Hosting is Easy, my name's John and today I'm going to show you how to host a Terraria server in just over a minute's time. Um, it's really, really that easy. What you need to do first is open your browser and get access to your router. The majority of routers use the IP 192.168.0.1. Uh, should you not have any joy with that, please look on the back of your router. You will usually find the IP and username and password to access your router. Um, once you've logged into that, we will go ahead. Let me just try and remember my password. There we go. You need to go usually to advanced settings. You will be looking for port forwarding. Now, now that we have the port forwarding rules, please have a look for add a rule and you can name this whatever you want. In this case, I'm going to be calling it Terraria because I'm a cool kid like that. And the first port that we want to add is 7777 and the end port is the same and make sure that you figure out your current IP address. So you can do that by opening your um, command and entering IP config, which will give you the IP address that you're currently using, um, which is 14 in this case. Um, I'd already created these, so you'll see that. And I believe that's it. So once you've forwarded that port, everything should work fine. If not, then um, just double check that you've set up the right rules and that your firewall is allowing Terraria to communicate outside of your local network. Now, while you're doing all this, please also keep in mind that um, you do actually need to have a decent internet connection to be able to host Terraria. And um, should that not work out for you, please, please, please head over to our sponsor, gameservers.com. Um, the link is actually in the description. And those guys will look after you with extremely cheap and super reliable game servers. Give them, give them a go. You'll, you, know, you won't be let down.